the gym. It's empty, which is good. I have the gym to myself, so I can work out. I was on my period for the last three days, so I didn't come to the gym. So today, I'm gonna be working out. I'm gonna be doing my legs and abs. Hopefully, I won't spend too long at the gym because of this recording, because I have a good reason for work. But one thing that I find a little bit hard to do is make breakfast in the morning. So here I was trying to figure out what I was going to eat. But in the end, I had a cup of coffee and two mini muffins. Usually, if I have time, I'll probably make a sandwich, bread, eggs, and something else. But I was running low on time. I had to log into work early. So I just made a cup of coffee and two mini muffins. And that seems to be my go-to lately.
disturbing Can you put the time on and rewind you? Help me understand, can you tell me now Why you made a war that we're fighting now while i try to get lunch ready let's talk about my failed diet plan so i'm just gonna give you guys a brief story of what happened i started this diet plan actually i won't call it a diet plan i started this healthy eating habit at the beginning of the year where i would have different type of bowls so it could be quinoa it could be couscous it could be a rice bowl and I was consistent at it you know sometimes five days in a week sometimes four days in a week but i was giving them back to back unfortunately i realized that this bowl that i was having cost me to buy groceries every week and when i tell you i'm buying groceries every week i'm not spending 50 dollars neither am i spending 60 i'm spending around 100 to 120 every week so I sat down and I started calculating. So one twenty dollars this week, one twenty the next week, and I one twenty the third week. Ah, four weeks in a month. That's like I'm not that good at math, though, but I would say that's four hundred dollars and some change. You know, no, sorry, four hundred and some some what dollars in a in a month for groceries only because I was eating healthy. So I now decided that okay, I'm going to. So I decided that I was going to pre-make the important ingredients like the broccoli, the um, carrots. So those constant ingredients that are going to be in every bowl, put them in the fridge, make it and put it in the fridge. And then I would make the couscous, the quinoa, whenever I want to eat it. So that helped me cut down on $200 from the $400 that I was spending. And then after a while, I also realized that it was taken into my time from work because I have to go to the kitchen, prep this thing from scratch, make the chicken from scratch. So I decided that I would do the kit the chicken on the weekend and then just warm it up. That also helped me cut down some time. In the end, it wasn't sustainable. <laughs> That's all I'm just trying to drive at. It wasn't so sustainable. I had to just think back about everything how much i'm spending how much time i'm using just to eat healthy but if you look at it eating healthy is not cheap that's something that i learned in this whole journey that i started eating healthy is not cheap and eating unhealthy is quite affordable that's why everyone or most people just sleep into eating what they can afford without thinking of the consequences it has on their health so is it like help me understand is it the government or what why why would this be this way like we're trying to live a healthy life we're trying to eat healthy but then our pocket is not affording these things it's like the government keeps increasing prices every day that it's not affordable anymore so we all just fall back on eating whatever is affordable to us and that's not how life should be i feel like everything should be affordable in order for the human being like me to live the life that we want now you come into my yard uninvited can you see me on the edge i'm not Would you cry or would you try to get me? Tell me now, but I want you to be clear, yeah. Tell me now, I need you to be clear, yeah. I will wait for you, for you. I will wait for you. I will wait for you. Get me. Can you put the time on and rewind, yeah Help me understand, can you tell me now Why you made a war that we're fighting now And you fall and you run When you see my big guns Run around, run away As the rebel comes out Then you call, call on me When you call me, I come